months and still there is no scientific consensus on the mysterious objects collected by the visitors. One popular theory is that the giant subterranean root-like networks were a type of von Neumann probe which swept across the cosmos billions of years ago when the Earth was one large supercontinent. It is thought that all 11 of the alien craft were positioned above these artifacts, buried deep beneath the ground at seemingly random locations around the world. Of these, half were situated at sea, and only the big three were located near populated areas. One left behind following the Hopi incident in Livonia has now almost completely withered away, presumably due to measures taken by the visitors themselves. Stories continue to abound regarding this failed extraction with many claiming authorities made a discovery some weeks before first contact was established. Reliable information on events, however, is difficult to confirm. Chaotic events in Livonia. Dr. Kessler, welcome to the show. Thanks, good to be here. You've only just come back from Russia. Is that correct? I've been sending out more intel. Imagine! Cosmic war parties are probably converging on the Earth as I speak. Preppers, I'm talking to you. Don't stop Primacy. Premier Natasza Pałka wyraziła ponowne ubolewanie z powodu pochownej reakcji wojska na obecność gości. Wczoraj w trakcie trwającego w Buenos Aires nadzwyczajnego szczytu ONZ w sprawie przybycia stwierdziła, że do tragicznych wydarzeń, jakie miały miejsce w pierwszym kontakcie, pośrednio doprowadziły zakłócenia komunikacji. Stwierdziła również... I was relieved, I guess. I mean, I figured not everybody could have messed up quite as bad as we did. I'm just glad they saw us. We are in our infuriating complexity. You know? At the moment, the scientific community is, well, honestly, it's, it's divided. Okay, we'll walk us through it, Dr. Rook. Okazało się, że warunki na pokojowe spotkanie były nie takie, jakich byśmy sobie życzyli. W trakcie wczorajszych wieczornych demonstracji w Andrzejowie przeciw obcym siłom wojskowym policja użyła siły przy próbie opanowania zgromadzonego przed rosyjską ambasadą tłumu. Water at the speed of light. The first step, however, involves constructing a huge 10-kilometer laser ray in orbit, employing 70 gigawatts of power. Fleet engineer on the project, Katja Rosyn has said components for the laser array will be launched on the anniversary of first contact in the summer of next year. A parallel project, ITER, is also commencing this week. It hopes to trace the trajectory of the visitors within the Sagittarius constellation, and then to beam a message at a fixed point using the medium of neutrinos. The message itself will be composed by the UN's one voice council and marks the first of many attempts to reconnect with alien life. Thank you.